Congratulations, Sunny. Um, first things first, fantastic performance. Um, what did you make of that from top to bottom tonight? Yeah, I thought I started quite well. Um, he set a good pace the whole way through. Um, one of my hardest fights to date. He didn't give me much time to, uh, to breathe or, you know, to get some space. He was coming in with his head every time. He was hitting after every break. Um, the ref was on him in the first half, but, you know, the ref knew why and what he was doing, so um, it was up to me to sort of take it into my own hands. I was trying to negate him. When he was looking for the rough tactics, I was just trying to negate it, put his head in the place that he didn't want to be. Um, and then outscoring on the clean shots when he was blinding himself, he had a very, very, very hard head. I mean, my hands are swollen to bits. I generally think I tore my bicep in about the seventh, eighth round. Um, you know, I've had a lot of fights back to back. I know I've had a little bit of layoff, but obviously, I was training for Martinez for a long time before um, that fight fell through and then I went straight into that. I've been sparring pretty much every single week for the last six months since I got out of the fight against Mohamed Vassim. Um, I probably need a little rest now. I'm putting my body through a hell of a lot as a 26. Um, I've cleared up my mandatory. Felix Alvarado came up as a champion with every ambition to, to win this title right here. Yeah. Um, I thought I won clear. I thought I won clean. Um, I don't think there was too much argument at the final bell, whoever won fought one. Maybe the scorecards were a tiny little bit closer, but the way I box, I get seven rounds clear and then I play with the other ones. I try and use his energy, I try and make him work himself out, and I feel like I did that today. What sort of message do you feel like you said to the big guns, Martinez, Bam Bam? I don't know. Um, I don't know. I think they all understand that Felix Alvarado is probably a very hard opposition. I think, you know, outside of your boxing casuals, they know Felix Alvarado was a good fighter, um, a very, very ferocious puncher, probably avoided in his own right, couldn't get no unifications. Again, that's all the story of my opponents. They can't get unifications, so then they come and eventually fight me because I can put on the platform. Do you know what I mean? So I can't just stay down at, super, uh, at, at flyweight defending against mandatory killers. Um, you know, if I don't get the Bam Rodriguez, I'm not going to hold my breath for Martinez. Nakatani's gone now. Dalek Kane didn't really want to know. I mean, I've been his page sparring partner a couple of times. Um, I'll probably go up to super flyweight. I don't know. We'll see. I'll sit down with my team. I've got a very good team. I've got a very experienced corner. Um, and yeah, another big event, another big performance for Steel City. I mean, that gym's close to my heart. I've got my coach's license now, so you might see me in Dalton's corner tomorrow night.